welcome to the news. Now look at the headlines. Minor schoolgirl rape case brings goikars on streets, protest in the port town, police release sketch of the suspect, culprit still at large. Chief Minister Manohar Parikar changes his plans of retirement, says he will not quit politics so soon, announces that government has finalised Loka Yukta, name to be announced soon. Mining dependent hit the capital city once again. Goa Mining People's Front starts indefinite strike at Azad Maidan, AITUC supports the move. MLA Vijay Sardesai's newly formed Goinka's first public meeting concludes amidst crowd of 1,000 people. Mopa Airport, Khazan Land Protection, Regional Plan on Goinka's Agenda. Sports Week and Mandavi Boys progress in all Goa Babu Brothers 2020 cricket. And Goa's young duo of Vindya Shinde and Mohis Kazi boost judo scene. Now the news in detail. The minor schoolgirl rape case at Vasco brought goikars on streets. Police have released the sketch of the accused. The PTA has condemned the act and demanded arrest of the accused and justice for the victim girl. Sadly, Congress has tried to play politics on the matter, blaming CM for the incident. The minor girl of seven years was raped in her school washroom by an unknown person. The medical test report of the girl is positive. It was a terrible day for a minor victim girl in school on Monday. She was sexually abused by an unknown person. The victim girl narrated that the unknown person was hiding in school washroom. When she entered the washroom, accused attacked the girl and raped her on the knife point. The headmistress of school is currently in police custody. Parikar said that it was a negligence on part of school management. This is, there is a definite negligence from the management. open. Security the parents along with their children held a rally condemning the act of school management and shouted for justice. The PTA of school met the deputy collector of Vasco, Girish Sankhwalkar, and demanded action against the culprit and the school management. I have requested the parent to maintain the peace and I have assured them that government is investigating the matter to full strength and the accused will be arrested very soon. And we just wish the culprit is caught as fast as possible. DIG OP Mishra said that the medical report has confirmed sexual assault with the victim girl. Mishra released a sketch of suspect. He said that special investigating team of the crime branch is investigating the matter. There is an act which was passed in 2012 is protection of uh, children from sexual offences act 2012 we have also incorporated the relevant sections from this particular act in this particular case 
थ्रू मेडिकल एग्जामिनेशन इट हैज बीन स्टैब्लिस्ड The sexual assault has been established. Pradesh Congress has blamed Chief Minister Manohar Parrikar and his administration for the alleged rape at Vasco. Congress party has demanded cancellation of BJP's Jana Sampark Yatra. We hold the administration along with the Chief Minister responsible for this. We strongly demand security may be given to uh, to schools. Uh, CCTVs may be put to uh, to immediate use. In fact, even if the government wants to bring in a legislation to increase the sentences, increase the make it a harsher sentence, we are there with the government. We demand strongly that all fast track courts may be in place. Meanwhile, students of Islamic Organisation of India in Goa has asked the government to take immediate steps to stop brutality on women in the state. Bureau report: Prudent. Chief Minister Manohar Parrikar has changed his plan of retirement. He says that he will not quit politics after 5 years as he feels that his presence is needed in active politics to clean up the system. He also announced that Lokayukta has been finalized by the Goa government and the name will be announced soon. He made this important announcement while launching Jan Sampark Yatra in capital city. Lokayukta already finalized. Prastha ta bhakta patra narpaje ne official formality karpaje. Mining dependent have hit the capital city once again. Goa Mining People's Front has started indefinite strike at Azad Maidan in Panji from Tuesday. They have demanded that legal mining should be started as soon as possible. AITUC has backed the dharna. People should be the center of all governments. People should be the center of all development. Just now, with the kind of dispensation that is there. both by the center as well as the state government and also by the other authorities there seems to be a certain amount of humanity cruelty again and a, a, a kind of a oppressive actions against the people of goa this we cannot uh, accept and we cannot tolerate for any longer therefore we have started a peaceful dharna this peaceful dharna will continue until our objectives of legal mining starting of legal mining are met and until our livelihoods are secure it's time for a short break stay tuned